Good morning. I hate this phone case because I keep dropping my fucking phone because it's too slippery. Hey, hi, how y'all doing? How are we feeling on this? It's Thursday, right? I keep thinking it's Friday. I don't know why I think it's Friday. Here is today's makeup look. Little Jack Skellington vibes. Yes. Like I said, today's color is purple. And um, you know what? I'm going to spray a little Fortnite on me. Is Jack Skellington even in Fortnite? Also, is Fortnite... Huh? Yeah. He is? Yeah. Oh, Brandon said Jack Skellington was in Fortnite. I didn't know. Do you have him? No. You suck. But I didn't play for like three seasons. Well, I don't know. But apparently, like, is Fortnite not cross-platform playing anymore? Because... Apparently, because Wifey has a PS4 and Hubby has Xbox, Brayden has Xbox, and then Hubby and Wifey went to go play, but then Wifey couldn't join because it was, like, not Xbox. So, I don't know what's going on with that, but I like watching people play. I personally don't play because I don't, you would think with ADHD, I'd have the brain capacity to play. Yeah. Fun fact, I do not. All right, let's walk through this insane makeup look not really that insane though is it really so for my base i used the white um foundation or concealer i used the white concealer and then i used my pricked palette isn't it so cute yeah okay so i used for the base layer on my eyebrow i used the color it's vitamin c word which is this color right there. I put that on my lid first. I also blended it out with um, Pale in Comparison, which is this color right here. And then to darken it up, I used Fashion Whore, <laughs> which is right there. I swear I'm going to get canceled from some of the shade names that Jeffrey uses before anything else so so yeah so there's um that you see he like my little sign right there but yeah so I used these three colors only in this palette I only I use this palette in the fall mainly around Halloween is the most I use this palette it's like my Halloweeny palette so then I went in with the jawbreaker palette and on my lid, the first color I used was Gumdrop, which is this pale purple. Then I busted out the mini jawbreaker and I used purple punch, which is right here. But then I also took this color, which is called foreplay. And I went back in and mixed it with the gumdrop in here, the pale purple in here. So I mixed those two and it like really matched this color. And I was like, oh, okay. But then I really, really, really love the color oral. Like this is my most, one of my most favorite colors. So I used that on top of the other two. And then I used um, Bite Me, which is the shimmery purple. So I used that on top of that. So those are the colors that I used there. And then let me put this away. And then let's put this back in here. Probably right, you can clean it faster if you didn't save your boxes. So, so what? So then I also used, well, I used um, the white when I put some more of the concealer down and patted it down. And of course, I used the weirdo color, the black color for my wings and the crease. And which palette did I use for my highlighter? Are you going to be like, oh, duh, right? You used the Platinum Pro. No, I didn't. I used the Brain Freeze palette because this has sickening colors in here, too. This is my other second most used palette. Um, so for I used Cold Shoulder on the cheekbones, nose. And then on top of the lid, I used, and in my uh, little corner here, I used Gold Breaker, which it says Gold Breaker, but it's actually a really pretty orange. And I love it the most. So, like, I use that a lot, especially in the fall. 
So, and then for the wing, I of course used, well, this is the white one, but I have the black one. So I used the black one for the little details. So yeah, that's my look. I just wanted to give it the little nightmare before Christmas wing. So that's my look for today. And it's like 8.30. So I also need, oh, let's do some lip gloss. First, I wanna put some lip balm on. So, oh, that is empty. Let's do my Shane Dawson. She is empty, y'all. Um, and then let's do, let's do this one. Is this a uh, pretzel drip? I like pretzel drip a lot. Any glazed donut. I wore that one all the time. All right, so there we go. There is today's look and I need, I am gonna wear my shoes. But I'm going to wear these and I just ordered heel things that you put inside of your shoe. They're like heel pads, but I'm going to put them on the back of my feet. I don't want to wear socks and I don't like socks. So that's that. All right, guys, let me go get my shoesies and stuff on and start. Oh my God, that scared the shit out of me. I thought somebody was standing in my window. My heart sank in my booty hole. I did not like that at all. I have my hair up in a high pony, but I'm really not feeling it. Do I have a few minutes? Like I'm not feeling the high pony. I'm not. So, okay, good, he's down here. Not breathing. So I had this over top of it, which worked, but it doesn't, like I said, I'm not feeling, I'm not feeling the vibe, y'all. I'm not feeling it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a loose pony. And then do this. I always put it like in a little pony. And then do it like that. And then it's like all poofy and fluffy. Let's see. Wifey taught me that trick. All right, guys. Let me go. I see you guys. I love you all. Bye. What is up, good people? I'm home. I'm home. Brayden has a friend out. It's the ferret. It's Rocky boy. His, what is he licking the camera for? Oh God, they stink. I hate the smell of them. I can't like Brayden, like since he has Rocket right now, he will reek of him for in, the rest, in, until, until he I, gets a shower yeah. tonight. Hi Rocky. So he's been having seizures and the vet said that there's really, for what he's going through. There's nothing they can really do about it because off of, off of what I remember Jen saying, it's something about his membrane or something. Yeah, something with his membrane. I didn't go to the vet with her, but. He's a, what is he? What kind of ferret is he? I call Panda. Yeah. You used to remember all the terminology from him because who's who's the cinnamon? Uh, is that either, Bella? It, it's either Bella or Gandalf, because they're both similar, but Bella's darker. So and I they change colors, and they change colors. But he's a panda. Yeah, yeah but Bella's always been the darkest one though. So yeah, and, and cinnamon sticks are kind of dark because at the same time. So well, there was a whole bunch of them because you said he was the panda. What was uh, Padfoot's the Blackfoot? Yeah. Uh, Blackfoot ferret. I don't know. Brayden did like all this research on him when we first got them, and he could tell. He don't remember now. He's like his mother. He has the br memory of a brother. If, um, okay. Memory of his mother. What? Look at Thor. Oh, he's cleaning himself. He's sunning himself. He doesn't like the ferrets because Mooney got him real bad. He like choked him out. 
So he doesn't really mess with the ferrets. What? 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 Meow. Meow. Look at my rainbows. You can really see my rainbows. What? Binkies. Hi. Hi. Hi, hi friends. Mommy's home. Door. Door. Hi, honey. You guys see the rainbow? Hi, Binkies. Hi, Loki, honey. Hi. Hi, princess. Hi, Kelly. Nixie was over here. Nixie, boo. Hi, Nixie, boo. <sighs> okay. Look at this mess. All hubby shit. Right at the corner. All right. Box. Let's make some sweet, dirty bean juice. Because sister needs some coffee to get through this evening. It was like mentally exhausting today. I like hit my phone and again, I hate this phone case. I hit my phone in the middle of the class. I touched something and all of a sudden an app opened and started playing and blaring during like our morning. And I was like, oh my gosh. Like I do get on my phone and I check here and there. Like I'll check stuff like I was... Um, on Twitter, but I was like looking for, I'm working on my next project, which is our bulletin board. Braven's got a cup of noodle shit everywhere. Um, the bulletin board for when we come back from spring break. And it's going to say, friends are the flowers in life's garden. And then on the bottom, I'm going to say, so choose your peeps wisely. And I'm going to have a bunch of peeps at the bottom of the board and it's gonna be like all floral. So, cause I have like floral borders, I have peeps borders, but April is also Autism Awareness Month. So, I'm not buying no more treats. I refuse. Ew. Daddy, leave a up here. So, if you guys want to see the cats get treats, I'm joking. I'm going to order them. So I didn't have time to order today. Um, hubby thinks that we need a new mattress. So, I need to start looking for a new mattress, and we're going to have. Um, a trailer here next week. Of course, I'm going to spring break to like clear out. Clear out the house. I might sneak that damn Instapot on the fucking trailer. Because I hate that motherfucker. I do. I hate it. What? What? So. But yeah. What are we doing, Callie? Crazy cat. So yeah, I'm gonna work on that. And get that done. Mm. <clears throat> and then what else? What else do I have to do at work? I don't know. I got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff going on. So, here's the whole bag of earrings that I made last night. I'm going to go down in the basement. And I have to get, because I have a whole another thing of earrings downstairs. So... I was thinking about opening an Etsy, my Etsy shop up again. Well, I've been talking about doing it, but I just haven't. I kind of want to wait till I get a P.O. box because of shady shenanigans and shady motherfuckers. So, because I don't trust people now ever since those things that had happened. Like, I don't trust anybody. So, I want to wait until I get a P.O. box. If I could find a P.O. box, if you guys know of this service existing or anything, not a P.O. box, because I know they exist, but I'm saying like if there is a service 
like a P.O. box service that you don't, it doesn't have a physical P.O. box, but everything that goes to that P.O. box is forwarded automatically and comes right to your house. So then that way I don't have to worry about going. If somebody sends me something, it'll just come right to the house, but they're sending in it, they're sending it to an anonymous email, like, or anonymous street address. Does that make sense? Just because, like I said, I don't trust motherfuckers. And if I get a P.O. box, it's going to be counties over. Like I had the last time. The last P.O. box, that was the other thing. Because I got it like two counties over. And I can only make it out there once a month. Like we went out there like once a month. Well, me and my girlfriend would go out there. And so, well not counties, but like cities. Two cities over. And we frequented there enough but not enough to go out and go check the P.O. box all the fucking time. And they're expensive. You get a P.O. box from the fucking post office, they're fucking outrageous. And then I think UPS has one too. But I do want to get another one again because I know some of you have like really been asking. So, I don't know. But I'm going to go relax and veg out for a few. I have to go, um, I have to help Brayden with a few things for school and all that good stuff. So I'm going to go do that. Drink my coffee fee. And live my best life. Oh, also, if you go to my vlog... If you go to my vlog from a few days ago, where I originally had the Timu haul and the pickle, the pickled, um, the pickle, fuck, jelly beans. If you go to that vlog and read the comments, there a foodie stand has found my wee little itty bitty channel. And they had jokes and I laughed at them. Because they said I was big as Chantel during the crackhead era. During the crackhead Olympics. Which was fucking hilarious to me. Because I'm still a hundred over a hundred pounds lighter than Chantel was in her crackhead Olympics. And even at my heaviest, I'm still lighter than her. And, um, well, at my heaviest, I'm lighter. Than, I was lighter than her than she is now. And then they were talking about, um, holy moly right here, my mole. And they were talking about my face wart. First of all, don't be knocking the mole, okay? It ain't going nowhere. I'm not getting a surgery. Doctors say it's fine. The roots are too ingrained. It ain't going nowhere. I will put a smiley face and a wig on this bitch and give her a personality. Y'all think I should do it? What should I need? Molly the mole. Molly Molly. Molly Molly. Holy moly Molly. I'll probably forget. So y'all need to remember. Remind me. So trying to come from my mole. Calling it a wart like on Chantel's hands. Sorry. These beasts don't chase no green peen. I got a perfectly plump peen. Upstairs. Taking a nap. Hence, why well, I get the sexy stuff from Shein. Because he likes it. He likes it. He loves it. I don't, he wants some more of it. All the time. All the time. But ain't got, ain't got time for that. So me and Holy Moly Molly are just going to live our best life. But I did. I told them that they were funny. I giggled and told them they were funny and they said thank you. So, tell Chantel I said hi. Tell her, tell her to go to my, tell Chantel, Chantel Marie, foodie booty, Miriam dot, whatever the fuck she wants to be called anymore. Tell her to go to my Raised Bakes channel. Tell her 
to go to my girl world and she should feel blessed she should feel privileged that she is the first in the series i did a foodie booty a girl world series one foodie a beauty foodie beauty um cupcake because i'm working on amber's next week and then i'm going to do some reaction channels yes yes i am all right so on that note um i'm gonna go veg i'm like really hungry but i don't really want to eat anything so i might just get a protein bar i might oh, do it no i don't want to do it i was gonna say i might get one of my legendary sugar-free pop tarts but they give me the shit so tonight for dinner, I'm just going to do like hamburger helper. I think that's just what I'm going to do. So. All right. I'm just going to sit here and woo saw for a few. And uh, all that good stuff. So I'll see y'all later. <laughs> What's up, friend? So it is... um. 621 I've been yakking my fingers do you know what that means I've been on Twitter's I've been on the Insta texting my bestie and then I got a snack earlier these things are so good have you guys ever tried these and they're not oh this one's got 22 carbs but these were good I'm glad I don't have them often but I wanted a little snack and I wanted something crunchy and I didn't want to eat nuts. Maybe later. See how hubby's feeling. No, I'm just, that's gross. Okay. Sorry. TMI. But I remembered I need to do the song of the day. Let's see. Song of the day. Today's song is a song you like with a person's name in the title. Ooh, okay. First song, there's three songs shouting at me right now. Hey there, Delilah. Da, 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 da. And then Billy Jean is not my love. And then, boom. Roxanne, Roxanne. I want to be your man. Roxanne, Roxanne. But that doesn't really answer the question, does it? Well, I named three. Because I have ADHD and I just can't do just fucking one. Okay? Okay. Any who's on. Mm. So. <sighs> <sighs> hubby doesn't know now if he we're gonna go do the show saturday's gonna be a washout and then hubby's like the only like he's like sundays are the only like mental health like genuinely like mental health day relaxation day and he's like if i have to work it all day um sunday he was like i'm not gonna have a day off and then i have to work monday and then work the whole week and then I was just like, well, I did offer. And I said, well, what if me and wifey did it? And he's like, well, that's, he's like, well, that's what wifey said. And I was just like, well, first of all, I loved how she volunteered me, but I can volunteer her too. <laughs> but yeah, so I don't know what's going on. I don't know if me and wifey are just going. Cause then he'll be like, if we don't go Sunday night, can we go bowling? Or if we don't go Sunday and do the show, can we go bowling Saturday? I want to go bowling so bad. I want to go bowling. I love duck pin. Duck pin's my jam. And we have coupons. 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 So... 
Roxanne, Roxanne. I want to be your man. I want to go live. So I'm going to go live. But I can't listen. When I, if Not today. But next week when I go live during spring break. Y'all can't be keeping me on the internet all day. Because I got shit to do. <laughs> Alright. Anyway. I'm going to go. Maybe record a couple TikToks. Because I need to upload some shorts. And all that. So. I think I told you guys I'm making like a man witch. Not man witch. Um. I'm making a hamburger helper for dinner tonight. Type deal. A type. Hamburger helper type deal. So. I don't know. We'll see. See what the future holds. And I got all these sublimination earrings coming too. Alright good people. Um, it's time to make dinner. Hubby decided I had took clams out for him and he said that he changed his mind. He didn't want they're like stuffed clams. The only seafood I eat is definitely not barracuda and I don't eat clams. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm very full of um dirty adult humor tonight dirty all the dirty jokes tonight <laughs> something in the air i don't know um all right is this phone case gonna sit i got the shitty ground beef this shit sucks but i am going to use it because i don't waste food wasting food is wasting money money is valuable and precious so we don't we don't do that around here in these parts because we some broke beaches okay we just we get and buy um so i'm making i'm just gonna do like a hamburger helper and call it a day and just call it a day this is still frozen, so. This shit's so greasy. I hate using this meat, but like I said, hubby's like, well, let's just get it because it's cheaper. And it's like three pounds or was this five pounds? I'm trying to get it out of the damn freaking wrapper that it's in. This is, this was a five pounder. So he's like, I just want to get it, you know, whatever, whatever. Because it was cheaper. I was like, yeah, but cheaper means cheaper quality, you know. Okay, so I just uh, washed my hands. I got to wash my skeezers. So I think I'm just going to do like a cheap beefaroni. Oh, but anyway, hubby decided he changed his mind. He didn't want the clams because I took, we have these stuffed clams. He bought a bunch of them. So I separated them into little meal packs for him. So, see, they're like little stuffed clams. And he's like, I don't really want them because they don't really fill me up. And I was like, oh, so I was going through the freezer because he's so particular. Like, so particular. And um, I was like, so what do you want? And he's just like, you know, he's like, eh, 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 you know. So, um, I found the wings, that bag of wings. And I said, oh, I found a bag of wings. Do you want wings? And he's like, yeah. Give me some wings. Oh, bless, blessed. We have bonds of pasta. This is the only pasta that I've done. I do now since surgery. Although I do have egg noodles, I think. No, I'm gonna save that for like a Alfredo or something. And I think I have. I thought I had a. I have a lot of hearts of palm. I have a lot of hearts of palm stuff. So, good. I have another box of bonza pasta. But I thought there was like a cauliflower pasta up here too. 
I thought there was. All right, and I do have, yes, I have the Velveeta. So this is what I use. I love this. This is the Velveeta Fresh Packs. They're so easy to use and delicious. All right, let me put these back up in here. I'm also thinking maybe what I might do is I might add a little bit of barbecue to it just to give it a little spice, just to make it like a smoky, you know, maybe, maybe. Is this doing anything? This huge rock of meat. So I need to, I wanna get the lid closed, but it's still hard as a rock. But if I can get the lid closed, it's going to take like 15 minutes or so for this to start cooking down. And then I think I have that tomato can from yesterday and then I'll just keep pouring the grease in. If I sit this in the middle, okay, good. Perfect. Perfect. All right, now that I got the lid on there, like I said, it's going to be a hot minute, so I'm not even going to start. I'm going to start my pasta after this is like about halfway through, to be completely honest. So, because that's going to be a hot minute. And then hubby's wings are going to be done shortly, so. Maybe I'll make some tuna fish. Maybe I'll make some tuna for lunches tomorrow. Maybe. Okay, so I got my ground beef done and drained. I have a whole can of grease in the sink. My noodles are just about done. My bonza pasta, my chickpea pasta. And I added some of the smoked onion already in there and some minced onion so now i'm going to add my Velveeta blocks all right so the only barbecue sauce that we have is this one the roasted garlic so i'm going to add some of that in there and we're going to add some milk to thin it out i got my Velveeta in the meat all right so i just added my milk in there i got my barbecue sauce in there the Velveeta is melting. If I need to add more cheese, I have some shredded cheese over there. And I'm fixing to start scoop my noodles in here. And start getting them in there. It smells so good. Like with the barbecue. Just something a little different. All right, so I added a little bit more of shredded cheese. I'm gonna put some on the top. Try not to make a mess doing this one-handed. Sometimes I'm like filming wonky or recording wonky because do you know how hard this is to do with like looking in the camera to make sure I'm in frame? All right, so there we go. There is my version of Hamburger Helper. All right, beaches, let's taste. Look at that cheese. Look at that cheese. Oh my gosh. And there's plenty here, so we should have enough for lunches and stuff tomorrow since it's Friday. Oh. Mmm. And uh, yes, I'm eating out of the pan because it's for me and my family, and y'all ain't got to eat my food. I'm feeling sassy today. Okay. Like I said. That barbecue sauce in it really gives it such a nice smoky flavor. And it's got that garlic, the onion and stuff in there. They, of course, they complement each other oh so very nicely. And... 
all it needs i think i think is pepper so i'm gonna add some of my seasoned pepper just because i like oh i didn't mean to add that much but who cares well he'll be like it's so spicy like hold up shut up and eat my shit you'll be fine okay so yeah there's dinner easy cheesy macarizzi all right let me feed the locals and uh start making lunches and clean up and call it a night i really my bedroom is a disaster i really need to put my laundry away laundry is if anybody could like if hubby was to ever bitch about one thing that i didn't do it was laundry i could get it washed dried folded and brought upstairs in one day but it takes seven to ten seven to ten business days with two holidays for me to put it away i hate putting laundry away I have two full baskets and I have a pile of dirty clothes on the floor. The front of my closet is a mess. I'm literally going through hampers trying to find clothes. <sighs> anyway. All right. Let me get the locals fed. Because I don't know if they're ravenous or not. But before they get ravenous. What's up, friends? Mm. It is 1 o'clock in the morning. I am on a call, <clears throat> on a group chat call. Um, so I, I've been on here all, all night. It's been really, really nice um, and fun. But uh, I need to take my ass to bed. So I'm sorry I didn't record giving, like doing the, um, making my protein shake and stuff. But I have to finish editing the vlog and everything. I am going to go to bed because tomorrow's still Friday and I still got shit to do. So, all right, guys, I love you all so, 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 so very much. Please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And as always, please be kind because you don't know what kind of battle someone's going through. So, don't be a dick. All right, guys, I love you so much and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.